everyone, it's me QP83. And Barbie0913. Today we are here with some products from the Queen's Treasures. They were kind enough to send these for review, so thank you, thank you, thank you. Uh, we love sharing the Queen's Treasures stuff with you guys mm -hmm. just because uh, it's a great company and the people who run it are awesome uh, and they deserve some, they deserve some publicity and yeah, I just really like their products. Mm -hmm. So we love sharing them with you. If you have never heard of this company before, where have you been? Exactly. Uh, so check out my channel to search for the Queen's Treasures in my videos and you should see some other videos featuring this company. Mm -hmm. So um, what do we have here? Do you know? That's the test. I do know what Ooh. we have. It is the farm furniture Set. We have the uh, hutch, the covered hutch, and we have the dining table with two chairs, and we have the splatterware plates and bowls and all sorts of fun things, and we have more. The, we have uh, silverware. Yes. So yeah, this is the farmhouse dining room set, which you can buy in pieces or you can buy as one big set. Mm. So there are options here. So this is uh, a couple different pieces. And they're all just really, really nice. Um, a few words about the company, the Queen's Treasures. It was founded in 2005, um, and they do lines on, uh, they have some really interesting lines. So like they have Little House on the Prairie line, they have a Jane Goodall line, um, they have some Salvation Army, like Donut Girl stuff. I like that stuff. That's yeah. what you'll find you know, if you look for that in our videos. You'll find right, you'll find like the stuff with the yeah. Donut Girls. So they have some really interesting lines. The majority of what you'll see is furniture on their website because they started out with furniture and then they've expanded to like doing some of their own dolls. Um, they also have like cute little things like plates and silverware and stuff and other smaller accessories to go with the bigger furniture pieces. And these are for 18 inch dolls, so think American yes. Girl, think their own line of dolls. You know, you get the gist, so whichever body works well for you. We kind of put some multiple dolls out here and we're going to just play with yeah. them. Yeah. So they do have a company store in Pennsylvania, by the way. So if you are in Pennsylvania, you could see their showroom. Um, it's in Strodsburg, Pennsylvania, which is apparently by the Pocono Mountains. So if you're in the area or you're traveling through the area, uh, check the hours for their company store because their, their showroom sounds pretty awesome to me. So let's see what to show off first here. Do you want to talk about the chairs and the table? Well, first let me just show mm. you this. The, these are the other parts that would go with the dining room and the kitchen. Um, you have the sink, you have um, the stove. Is there a refrigerator on here? I don't know if there's a, I don't think so. I don't think there's a, a refrigerator. But these two up here would be additions to your little room, mm -hmm. which are really cool. We have the oven. Do we? The this stove. Oven? This oven? I, I thought we had we the do. donut one. Oh yeah, we do. We Which I think is girl. different. Oh, okay. And then there's little food packages that you can buy so they can have more than just their cups on the table. Yeah, and, and there's, there's, there's also more contemporary pieces like um, stands, stalls that you could decorate like as a shoe stall or bakery, baked goods or stall. Or like the, yeah, the, uh, uh -huh. the fruit stand yeah, kind of thing. Yeah, fruit stand, yeah. stand is a better word for or it. Or you can adjust <laughs> it and make it whatever you want. Yeah, so there's more contemporary pieces. They're not all like pretty and vintage like these. Yeah. I just generally prefer the pretty and vintage pieces. So this is the table. These are made of wood, like good quality wood. You do not put it together yourself. It comes no. already put together. Yeah, two chairs, so this comes with the table and the two chairs. You'll see all the details here, like just it's really well painted, just it's super sturdy. And um, it's packaged well. Really well. Yeah, yeah. I will say really well. Um, this piece has a piece of wood at the bottom and the top just to make sure that it doesn't get smashed. So I thought that was really caring about how it's going to end up right. at your house. And proportion wise, this looks pretty good. We have. Well, figure she's the 18 inch doll, so this mm -hmm. would be made more for her style. Right. The cups, I still think, are not quite proportionate, but it's cups. Um, they are cute. It has a, like an empty, this is like a full thing. This is really yeah. heavy. It's made of wood, apparently. Is it wood? That's what it said on the website. It's made, uh, it's wood with hand painted splatterware pattern. 
Oh, how so, cool. Yeah, because like, when I lifted it, I was like, this is a very strange material. It's very material. metal. I thought it was metal. <laughs> no, well, that is, but the rest of it, it said it was wood. But if she holds it with her hands, she's got those big American Girl hands, too. It is, it's kind of, it's almost there. Yeah. Um, she works well in it because her legs, when you sit her down, they don't flange all the way out like an American Girl doll does. Mm -hmm. So they stay in a little bit more, so hers aren't too bad. Right. And she is it actually a doll from the company, so right. she's a Laura Ingalls doll that they sell. So it makes sense that proportionately she's she in fit front well. Of them. Right, I would table, hope that. Right? Yeah. Um, yeah, but the chairs, just even to the back, super nice. Nice little back there. See the I would have liked detail. a cushion. That I would have liked, a little cushion on there so it wouldn't be so hard because I can think of all those little old grandmas and they were making the little cushion, the back cushion and the bottom seat cushion. Mm -hmm. So I, I would like to have seen that. But that but could be a crafty you do when you buy it. Yeah, crafty you do. <laughs> <laughs> We've turned it into a DIY. <laughs> so when she stands at the table, it's not that bad mm -mm. at all. It's just no, right. It's really good for her. I do really like the uh, splatterware. The splatterware. I think it's just really nice. And like I said, it's like hand done, hand painted splatterware. Well, that makes it the splatter part. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Well, yeah. But it's just super cute. And you can see all the other pieces here. There's uh, 12 pieces total in this. So we've taken some of these out here. The um, plates and the cups are made of wood. The bowls are, yeah, the bowls are made out of something called poly resin. So it's a resin. Yeah, so it's much lighter than you will you would feel the, the plates and the cups right. to be. But you have a lot of nice pieces and they're all unique because it's hand done. Uh, oh, and the platter as well as that poly resin, which I really like the platter. And I like that they really do stack. And they do stack. Very, which is cool. Yeah, they're inspired by the 1800s of a, as a popular sort of material. Well, the, the whole chair even mm. looks the date of it. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, I really do like these though. They're super cute. The silverware I get a kick out of. It comes in its silverware box. It's so cute. Yeah, there's 13 pieces in there. Comes with your forks and your knives and your spoons. And of course, the little ribbon that normally goes mm. around your little silverware box. Little, little wooden box. And then these are uh, high quality silver. They are. It's a very polished nice pattern. silver. It's a good pattern it for is. them to pick. It's a really pretty. And so it we have is. the fork, and we have the spoon. So we're just lacking food for our platter, <laughs> which would be nice. And then the knife. Yeah. Yeah, these are like really pretty just to like have on display. Um, Another yeah, really doll that I put up here, I thought that was pretty much proportionate to it, is that Shirley up there. It's not bad for her size at all. Mm -hmm. She's happy. She's going to dinner. Somebody wants to feed her. <laughs> um, if we did, I might as well do this over here. Let's see. Ellerin's Prue is basically an MSD size. I know she fits all the MSD things, um, which it still looks a little dwarf for her, mm -hmm. unless she was a little girl kind of MSD. Right. Um, she has to kind of raise her body for the table. What else do we have? While we're switching it out, I will say uh, there's a coupon code. If any of these items uh, here or on the website are things that you want under the Christmas tree uh, or just in your own collection, use the coupon code CONFESSIONS at checkout and you'll get 10% off of your order and that includes sale items. So definitely take advantage of that 10% off code. Back. Bex. Has, Bex has been playing with it lately. She fits the table. She I fits she it. Yeah, it's just that her knees don't yeah. bend. If her knees would <laughs> bend, it would be perfect. But even like the cups kind of fit her. Like I think the cup fits her. It fits her more. Yeah. And the plate fits her. Yeah, the, all of this looks like it would be a good fit and her. she's a girl for all time so if you don't know where she comes from and then i just brought a sasha to show for size that's not too bad for the hutch mm. and then our saint of course our dolls right. from heaven which it's a little it would it's about the right size because you had right little size. short little hutches right she, or she's very tall she's a very tall sister <laughs> so that's about what it looks like with different sizes this yeah part. 
So not too bad. So hopefully this gives you more of a feel of what might fit this, but generally speaking, it's 18 inch esque size dolls. But some of these, like he's like 16, right? He's I think shorty. she's 16. She's 15 or 16. So that is not too bad. So we're gonna take those off and then we'll show you the hutch. Right. So this is the hutch or the cupboard, um, whatever you wanna call it on the website that's described as both things. Mm -hmm. um, so again, wood. Nice, sturdy, good quality uh, furniture piece here for your 18 inch doll. Nice little details. Faux wood grain in the back. I like the wood grain. It's cute. Um, they do label their pieces. Nice. I guess in case you like break one or need a, you need a part. Thing. Um, this is what the back looks like. Yeah. All one piece. You don't have to put it together. Mm -hmm. You're not breaking your neck saying, oh my goodness, it's Christmas tomorrow. Right, exactly. Let's get it together. Yeah. Uh, so yeah, I really like these these open the drawers open which i like Ta -da! the drawers that open so you can totally use this space to store things you'd be like oh these are gonna go in there for the moment or your placemats or your tablecloth mm -hmm. they can go in there right let's go in please there you go it's taking a little in there. There's a, like a little hinge, like a little stick that goes in here. So if you need to fix it again, you can probably re-put another stick in there. I think the one thing that you had mentioned was like this didn't slip in It doesn't here. fit in any uh, of in those drawers. You can't just put the silverware well, I mean, in one of the drawers. You can probably put, you it, put it, it down here. One, but who wants Wait, to have to on. bend all the way down to get their silverware? Yeah. Doll yeah. or human? Yeah, yeah. so actually that does it close oh it won't then. close it then yeah so you can so you kind can't. of hide your silverware in here <laughs> but it won't close so this is just like a wee bit Sit on too the long yeah. uh, so it would have to go here where it does fit well right uh, and my other uh, suggestion was it doesn't have a plate rail oh to go something like to do like that to put the well the plates yeah so that the plates don't fall down mm. you know, like normally you have a little rail there I know it would have to be kind of thick for this but Probably. it would be a nice little addition. Yeah, that would be nice. But even so, like as is, this is a pretty awesome piece. I like it. And it just looks really pretty display-wise. You can put all the pieces there. You can do like that. Make it all pretty, like. It's fun, fun for picture taking, fun for if you have, um, Little ones that like to play with furniture. I mean, I love playing with the furniture. I just don't have any space for all the <laughs> furniture. Yeah. But this is really cool. And it's sturdy. Yeah. Oops. I think it's because we're trying to do it from the side. There. Like They do clothes easier from the yeah. front, but we're trying to do it weird. We're doing it weird. <laughs> um, but yeah, this is the Hutch. Super cute piece. I think it's worth it proportionate to the dolls right. of that size right? and totally fits in with like the vibe and like the, the, the vibe of the line and like the company in general I think like this is a good they example have, of what they do. When they do the toy shows they have a beautiful display of their furniture mm -hmm. up so it's really nice. So nice. And uh, like you, you mentioned there is a code Yes, a coupon code in case you forgot. <laughs> um, just type in confessions at checkout mm -hmm. and you'll get 10% off of your order. That includes sale merchandise. Uh, and there are a lot of times when things go on sale. I think right now things are on sale, uh, maybe possibly even these pieces. Mm -hmm. So definitely use that. As far as shipping goes for the holidays, obviously with any company, order like soon mm -hmm. or, you know, not right before Christmas, but they are in the US, so it shouldn't be terribly complicated to get your right. package relatively quickly. Um, but so order soon. And if you have questions, ask the company. Yeah, and definitely talk to the company. They're super nice. Uh, and you can tell like her company, like she strives to have quality pieces out on the market mm -hmm. that are affordable, right. as opposed to cheap pieces that are more expensive uh, that you may see at other companies. So that's about it for this video. Um, a huge thanks again to the Queen's Treasures for sending these for review. Uh, we very much appreciate it, and I'm sure you guys do too. Let us know what your favorite piece is in this video, and definitely check out their website. Uh, 
see if there's something that floats your boat, let us know what it is, and use that coupon code CONFESSIONS because it's 10% off your purchase. So mm -hmm. that's a great, a great deal. Uh, and there's still time to get stuff uh, in for the holidays or for whatever you're celebrating. For whatever. Yeah, for just the uh, I want to gift myself something you day, go. you know? Um, so yeah, let us know all of that and we will talk, talk. to you later. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.